Hello there. In this video, I am just like to will demonstrate that how we can book a medicine and book an appointment with a doctor to the Google Dollar Flow. So without any further delay, let's get started with this video. After clicking on the optional create agent, I get redirected towards the web page where I have created an agent, namely Medicare for the challenge. Let's select OK. As we all know, an intent is used for asking and satisfying our query, whereas in entities we use that same query for creating synonyms or meanings so that we can get our desired responses from the chatbot. Okay, now let's come back to our web page. So these are the intents I have made for the challenge. Let's click one of them to see what I have done. I have selected Medicare.Service. So these all are the user expressions or the user responses that will be given by us to the chatbot. And under it, we have the text responses, or we could say the messages which will be given by our chatbot to us. Let's save it and move further. So there are more intents, as you could see over here. And that's it. Moving further towards the entities. So these are some of the entities which I have created for the challenge. Let's click one of them. So these are the synonyms which I have kept for the doctor. That is doctor, 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 doc, doctor, and etc. Now let's move forward towards the most important part of this video that is testing this chatbot. In my previous video, I have tested my chatbot using the web demo. But in this video, I will test my chatbot using the dialogue flow messenger. Yes, it's name. Let's try it. As you could see over here, there is a message popping up, which is a good sign. Let's ask some questions to our chatbot and test it. Okay, it is asking us to choose whether you want to book a medicine or book an appointment with a doctor. I will choose book a medicine. Okay. Okay, now it has mentioned all the details regarding the medicine and its costs, including all the taxes. So it's asking us a question that is anything else you require. I would reply to as no, thank you. Okay, thanks for assuring. Kindly enter your address so that we could deliver you the medicine. That's apt. Also mention your email address for our future references. Now, why is it asking our emails? Suppose if we aren't available to pick up our address, it will just mail us or if there is a emergency or in delay of booking of the medicines okay so i will enter my address and my email address just random address i'm doing Also, I'm using a uh, email ID which is not valid right now. It is just for an example. Okay, 
Now, for confirming your booking, we have to just copy paste this link and just enter it in our browser. All right. Yes, please confirm my booking. Okay. Now let's move towards the second service, which is booking an appointment with the doctor. Here I've completed now just the booking of medicines. Let's test the another one. So for this, I have to apply the same process that is going towards the Dialoflow Messenger. Try it now. It will again give us a pop-up message. And now I will enter two for service two, that is appointment with doctor. Okay, I'm suffering with indigestion. Okay, don't worry about it because I have found many relevant doctors for you who will cure your ailments. Kindly mention the date on which you will be available so that we could arrange your appointment with the doctor. Also enter your email address for your future references. Okay, so we have to enter the date as well as the email address. So 24 March, I'm just entering today's date. I'm again using that random email address. Okay, enter. Okay, now we have to again copy paste this chatbot link for confirming this appointment and we will good to go. Yes, please confirm the appointment. Okay, it has been done. So that's what it. Thank you so much for watching this video.